So it's sad to know that people hate so many different products in the world. That people hate this, people hate that. And um, I was just thinking today why people um, hate Intel because I have an Intel Pentium processor. And there's a whole AMD versus Intel war going on within the PC community, which is it's really hilarious because they all claim to be, you know, the master race, and yet they bicker between each other. Uh, but here's the thing, okay? AMD processors, it wouldn't surprise me if maybe they were just a tiny bit better, okay? And when I mean a tiny bit, I just mean a little smidgen. The reason is because they focus their entire industry on making processors and things like that. Whereas Intel, um, I think that they, correct me if I'm wrong, but they do other stuff. Um, Intel is, actually, no, I think they both make, they both just make processors. But, here's the thing, like, AMD is more expensive. So, basically it's this, guys. It's an elitist war. Um, I assume you guys are going to make fun of me for shit, you know, for this video and how I'm stuttering a little bit and stupid shit like that, but I don't really care. This is an elitist war. You know, oh, oh, you're, you're a peasant because you use Intel. You know, Intel, which is in, you know, the PC towers of, of office desktops you can get for under $300. It's all just an elitist war, guys. You have to understand that. These, these dumb masturbation race, mustard race people, they think they're better than us just because, oh, they have the top of the, you know, line equipment. Because, oh, my, my shit, you know, oh, you can press a button and I can wipe my asshole. You know, I, I can, I can press a button and it'll diddle my nipples for me, you know. I mean, it's just, it's so stupid. It's just, it's, elitism is the reason why I can understand why people don't care about video games anymore. I think that less and less people, honestly, are getting interested in video games because of these elitists. I don't think gaming is quite as popular as it used to be, sad to say. Um, I mean, sure, lots of people still game, but if you think about it, like, it's just, it's riddled with fanboys, and I just wanted to talk about this whole AMD debate because I've had a lot of elitists come at me with that bullshit, saying that, you know, you have to have an AMD processor. AMD this, AMD that, you know. And uh, the truth of the matter is, Intel makes fine processors. Um, I remember a guy, and bless his heart, he, he really did his best to help me at Best Buy, but this employee who sold me my, my uh, PC tower, I'm not going to say his name, but <laughs> he was, you could tell he was a real like AMD fanboy. He was telling me, oh, you know, don't, don't buy the Intels, they're worse, they're terrible. But it's not true. They're fine. Uh, the processor I have works fine. I mean, yes, it's you know, it's a fucking i3 processor, which is not exactly the most powerful. But uh, I'll eventually change it out. But for for what it is, it works fine. And by the way, AMD fanboys, I just want to warn you: the i9 processor will be in stores very soon. That's right, we got i9 now, so. Be afraid, AMD fanboys. Be very afraid. I don't know the complete specs on the i9 processor, but it looks pretty fucking powerful. So it's going to give you guys a run for your money. But like all I can say, guys, is just play what you want to play. If you like AMD, you know, if, if AMD makes you happy because you have an AMD processor, that's fine. You know, um, I, I don't really... I don't understand why people feel like they're, you know, so superior just because they have a different brand name. Uh, but yeah, AMD is more expensive, so just realize that if you do get an AMD processor, you will be spending a lot more money, and in the end, you are getting ripped off. And look, I'm just going to be honest. I mean, I think Intel is overpriced, too. I mean, I think, I, I believe buying an i7 processor, just a basic i7, like not even hyper-threaded or anything, is going to run you close to $300 for a tiny little chip I can put in my tower. 300 bucks. I think that's pretty stupid. But, you know, it is what it is. It, at least it's not as expensive as AMD. So I just wanted to make this video, guys. There's nothing wrong with Intel. 
don't believe people when they tell you it's crap. You know, oh no, you know it doesn't look quite as you know, glittery and magical like a unicorn's asshole. You know, like AMD. Oh no, it doesn't look. You know, it looks fine, guys. Okay, I swear, some of you guys are hilarious. The way you compare the picture of two different things when they look practically identical. I mean, really, it's it's just stupid. Anyways, guys, thanks for watching. Peace.